I've been working all week with only one thing on my mind. I don't care if it's spring, summer, fall, winter, rain, or shine. I got a woman that thinks I'm crazy, cause every time I close my eyes, will I see whitetails, blood trails, monster bucks, a one anella, I can't wait for us to be on. Slinging litter red heads, I hear a gobble up ahead, end up in a strutting zone. That's unbelievable. I can't stand not being out there. So when I'm home, I gotta get them boys on the phone. spot and we've got uh, just two night hunts left and tomorrow morning but things are looking up it cooled down quite a bit and, uh, farmers out cutting the corn just down the way which is nice because it's up pretty late this time of year for what we're hearing so we've been seeing some deer moving around the area pretty much all day mostly does and such but we're feeling pretty confident they might start moving tonight Last night was kind of slow, I'm not going to lie, it's been pretty slow all week. Everyone's kind of puzzled, but we feel pretty confident we're going to get it done here the next day or two before we have to go back. So, we're going to camp out here in this ground blind. You can see we got our black sun lock on. They're not going to smell us, I don't think. We just got to get one to come in and get an arrow in them, so we're going to stay after it. Well, it was a fun afternoon. We had probably 40 deer come through, some as close as five yards. Just right here, downwind, they all go southeast where the winds come from. Not one of them smelled as a scent lock with carbon alloys. Just unbeatable. I think eight or nine does put their noses up three times, sniffed as hard as they could, right on top of us here. Straight downwind and never once they smell us. So it's a true testament to the scent lock. It's working. Matter of fact, there's a deer right up in front of me right now just looking while we're doing this. So. It's good stuff. Uh, we got a good wind tonight. It's blowing pretty hard out of the southwest, probably 15, maybe gusts up to 20. So should be perfect for this spot, and hopefully we can get it done. Wind wasn't so good here the other night. And didn't really matter because we had the scent lock on, but we wanted just perfect, and hopefully we get a big buck to come in. Now I grew up down an old dirt road in a town you wouldn't know. Pops picked the place up for 1500 bucks back in 1964. My grandfather was a drinker back in the day, he put him down. But a war is known to change a man, and the whiskey's known to change a man. That's not me. Still live in the sticks where you wouldn't go In a town of 1200 off an old dirt road And a country boy is all I'll ever be Now it's been 12 years Here we are, home sweet home He said sign your name here on the dotted line And your songs they all Set up shop on sunset, he put me up at the marquee He said, you want to sell a million records, boy, better listen to me He said, change your style, widen your smile, you could lose Maybe we'll get one big one to come through here, I'm praying We fought it so darn hard all week We're giving everything we can, we're trying all the Tried some rattling that worked last night. We're just gonna 
say an open break, but one looks by and we could have done this. We put in our effort, that's for sure. And I like my jeans and my old t-shirts And a couple extra pounds never really hurt Cause a country boy is all I'll ever be Cause Hank taught me just how to stay alive You never catch me out the house without my 9 or 45 truck and my idea of heaven's chasing white tail bucks and as a country boy you know I can survive now two flags fly above my land and really sum up how I feel one is the colors that fly high and proud the red, the white, the blue. All right, you can tell it's getting late here. We got about 20, 30 minutes left to shoot it light. You can see there's a doe straight downwind of us. We got a good, steady southwest wind. And we just got covered up with does. We've had our mass on, we've had our sun lock on. And these does at five to 10 yards, nothing, they don't even flinch. This one down here is just checking us out, so. We're out here with Barry Ross and uh, Team Real Tree. Bill Jordan and our Tucker had me out. And had some other guys out. They took off a few days ago, so just Art and I are finishing up. And we're gonna do our best to get one stuck yet tonight. We still feel pretty good. We know there's a ton of buckets in this country. It's just been tough all week. It's a little bit warm. And for some reason, the big ones just aren't moving, so we're gonna stay after it. Stuck here soon. I also got this new uh, Bear Archery Arena 34. Thanks to Bear and uh, Art over at Real Tree for that. It shoots real good and I like it, so I'd like to put it to use for the first time tonight. Kansas later in the season. We're working on that right now, but 